Hello folks, this is 2022, October, November, paper 13, and the question number is 34. It's concerned with the chapter current electricity. It says that a voltmeter reads a 9.000 volt when it is connected across the terminals of a battery. So, connected across here. It gives this much. When a resistor of resistance 11.0 ohm, 0 ohm is connected in parallel to the battery, to the battery, the voltmeter reading changes to 8.800 volt, like this. So it means that in this condition, the voltmeter is measuring its EMF, EMF, which is 9.000 volt. Because we assume voltmeters are ideal, if nothing is said, that means they have got infinite resistance, let us say. And here it is simply measuring, it is simply measuring at this time the EMF of the source, because no other resistors are available there. Now, when we do this, it is measuring the terminal potential difference. Vt is equal to 8.800 volt. Because here, the current flows through this path and there is some loss here. Some loss here. So, the PD here is, is less than the overall EMF that it can give. So, that is Vt. So, we need to find the interresistance. So, we need to find this R equal to what? So, the given conditions that we have here is r is given here r is given e given vt given we need to find this small r here we know that we know that this e is equal to is equal to v outside plus v inside potential loss there so if i uh, subtract this thing so this v outside is equal to the terminal pd terminal pd so if i divide the whole thing by vt it becomes e by vt is equal to Vt by Vt plus Vi by Vt. So this is equal to 1 plus here Vt equal to this equal to current into this thing and the current into this thing. Because the PD here will be equal to current flowing which is I, I into small resistance and current the PD here will be equal to I into the large resistance. This is equal to 1 plus small r by r. This one goes this side. So E by Vt minus 1 is equal to R by R and which gives us R is equal to E by Vt minus 1 and then R. So let's apply the formula here. So this R will be equal to E is a 9.000, Vt is 8.800 minus 1, then our R is equal to 11.0. This is equal to, this is equal to, so 9 divided 8.8 .8 minus 1 equal to into 11. So this becomes 0 0.25. Now in order to maintain the significant figures or if I follow the rule of significant figures strictly, it should be three significant figures here. So 4SF, 4SF, this is infinite, which is 1. 1, which has got infinite significant figures, this is 3. So I am using the least among these. So R should be this much. Oh. So if I go to the answers, this be becomes the correct choice.